just hoping to see this city better. And then when I just had an idea that it's gonna be better, it was worse. I feel nostal nostalgic. Uh, for open mind uh, thinking and conversation with, uh, without uh, pressure, without pressure of, of war or politics. Amongst the people of the Balkans, there is a saying, Na mladima svijet ostaje. It carries a double meaning. The youth will inherit the world, and the future of the world depends on the youth. For the young people of Kosovo and Serbia, states that recently separated after a bitter conflict, this means inheriting a world full of division and strife, from which then, as the saying goes, they have to find a way to build a future. I consider that we're all humans, we all breathe, we all eat, we all have the same needs, we all have the needs to love, to, I don't know, be angry or whatever. Probably on next five years, people will start to respect each other. I think that people here uh, can show hands with each other, uh, they will, I will, I believe. The city of Mitrovica in the north of Kosovo poses a unique set of opportunities and challenges for creating a common future for the peoples of the area. Mitrovica is one of the few places where Serbs and Albanians live in close proximity to each other. But since the founding of the Kosovo state and splitting of Kosovo from Serbia, Mitrovica has lived as a divided city. The river Ibar that has sustained the city's life since the 14th century now serves as a natural barrier between the two communities. Serbs live on the northern bank of Ibar and Albanians have almost entirely retreated to the south. A huge part of citizens of North Mitrovica don't like to see Albanians on their side, so they have so much security issues that cannot be solved and at the moment. Maybe in future that will be solved, but for now the situation is like that. Mitrovica North, although well within the territory and jurisdiction of the young Kosovar state, has close ties to the Serbian capital Belgrade. The government in Belgrade does not recognize Kosovo state, and Mitrovica North, with the surrounding area, is where Belgrade is able to keep its influence and presence in Kosovo. Citizens of Mitrovica North do not recognize the Albanian authorities located in Mitrovica South and run a separate municipality staffed by local representatives who run on the platforms of political parties of Serbia. While in the north the predominant feeling is anger over Serbia losing the territory of Kosovo and determination not to let go completely, in the south the mood is a combination of celebration and trying to move on from painful memories of war. People shared war stories but hesitantly and always away from the camera, as if saying to themselves and us that they don't wish to be defined by their experience. Ardiana explains. It's difficult to remember even that time, you know. Mm. Sometimes even it hurts. So when you think, when you just think for some very, very extremely bad situations, and people start to talk about that, let's say that you have a strange feeling, probably you just moved on that period of time, you know, and you, you have the same feeling just like that. Mistrust between members of these two ethnic groups is then not surprising. Perhaps more surprising is the young people's willingness to move on and to create a better world. On the first floor, in Mitrovica North, we visited a new youth center just about to open. Oni su sad u nekom vakumu. Posleratno stanje, nebezbednost, nedostatak kulturnih dešavanja. Ako se držimo one da na mladina sve to ostaje, onda moramo mlade da the youth center is on the one hand for all, as people running it emphasize, but on the other it is only for those who can safely make it there, meaning for now, for the Serbs and several other minorities, 
such as Turks who live in the north already. Serbian youth and their organization. Because so far what I witnessed here that the youth does not cross from one side to other. Am I right? Yeah, yeah, you are right. Because because of all this tension and this this division, it's 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 not possible to organize because of the security issue. It's not it's not possible to organize the the, uh, the common activities. And you can see in the like in the minute time they can be somebody from that side throw stones and you know always troublemakers. And do you ever talk to people on the other side of the river? No. <laughs> Would that be dangerous? Yes, they look dangerous. And yet, encounters do happen, as in the case of Milos and Ardiana. I met Milos for the first time uh, on the end of, by the end of February. You know, We just started to work for CBN. And we had to take a taxi to Pristina. And then we had a lot of conversation. And I think that... Uh, it was the best thing was that from the beginning we started to talk openly. We are really good colleagues. I I help her in every way that she needs my help. She also helped me in every way. We started at, like colleagues and now we are friends. The Kosovo conflict in 1999 came as the third and final of the conflicts in the Balkans since the dissolution of Yugoslavia. The previous two conflicts in Croatia and Bosnia and Herzegovina also loom large over the youth in the area. They contribute to the sense of division and isolation. This is especially the case for the Serbian youth whose country, under the dictatorship of Slobodan Milosevic, has participated in all three of the conflicts. Uh, today, young people, they're desperate for contact with, uh, with young people from Zagreb, from uh, Skopje, young people from Montenegro, or from Kosovo. They're desperate for, for um, new connection, new bond. I mean, he might be red, he might be purple, it doesn't really matter as long as I can have a normal communication with him. And that's my stand. And I don't know about other people, I'm just saying that really, really does affect the fact that people do not have the opportunity to meet others. Um, I had a project um, working, let's say that, on uh, what do people uh, see Mitrovica in 10 years. Mm -hmm. so, and they were most of them, most of young people, they see perspective, you know. Mm -hmm. They say that... Um, they, 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 they may cooperate to make our lives easy. We left this part of the Balkans and the town of Mitrovica, all too aware that violence could ignite ethnic tensions again and further strain the relationships between the groups of people. But we were also encouraged by the people, and especially by the youth, that the river which now separates could soon become a sign of a new life that flows through the city and the region, healed of the strife and division, and moving towards the kind of future the students we talked to envisioned for themselves and others. Se od Daytona godine broje, ljudi se ljudi boje i svako glasa za svoje Brđani postaju građani, do juče svjetla gasili sjekirama, ali sad su od jelima Mirne se sredi, mirne se jebi i mater, ako se ti počneš prodavati, tebi ću mater i bava Da znaš, nije bitna ideologija, bitna je biologija, bitna je genetika, bali je ustaše i četnika Svaka ovca svome krdu krave u stela, u šarena vrata gledat jedni drugima mater jebat Znam ko je počeo rad, znam šta je glad, znam kad su šašljerci došli u moj grad Pričam o onom kako je sad Slabo se mićemo s mjesta, puni smo rupa ko naša cesta Često vučemo ručnu, vidi svaki biser Išli bi napred, ali volimo taj reklic Postalo nam navika da ne radi nijedna fabrika Malverzacije prešutimo, gaze ne ljutimo Navikli se, na kebiru i u miru Mladi zemlje bježe, izbjeglice se vratit neće Ne moraju, nek zarađuju, nek nam šalju para Mi ćemo živit u mraku, jedni drugima jebavat majku 